Good morning, Gatsby. Wow, you have such a hard life. And right now, I am redeeming all my Amiibo stuff for Hyrule Warriors. I just did Sheik and I did Link. You can do Zelda now. Weapon. Woo! Let's try Mega Man. Yeah. Oh, one rupee present. That's so stupid. Diddy Kong. Oh, look. I got a scepter of time. Cool. I'm liking this game too. I'm driving over right now to play tennis with my friends Chris, Brian, Christian, and John. All from Cornell, so awesome. And guess what I got here? Gatsby! Woo! You could never make eye contact. Everything you got was based off of my contact. You were floored, but I will remain eye contact. The Lindsayagas on my boots with a python strap. It's watching the tennis courts. We're waiting for one of the courts to open up. Gatsby hanging out. <laughs> John's gonna take care of Gatsby while we play tennis. Yeah, yes, yes, do that. Just keep running. While we go and play some tennis, we got the court open after half an hour of waiting. Gatsby's like the perfect height. So he like fits it in his hair. <laughs> Look, there's Gatsby. <laughs> Gatsby looks so happy right now. Watch it. So we're winning right now, me and Chris. Yeah. <laughs> Two to five. We're taking a break. Gatsby's watching the game up here. So tired. Gatsby is so nice and like well behaved right now because he's all exercised. Yeah, Gatsby? This is fun, watching the game from here. <laughs> it's a nice 700 degree day today. Yes, we under the table here. Hanging out at the Mediterranean Grill for lunch. Look at all this. Oh, it looks so good. Excited. Doing some work over here. Programming off of like three screens at the same time. Craziness. Doing the Bagel Bite dance right now. Yeah. Two minutes and 21 more seconds. So the Bagel Bites are ready. Whenever the camera comes out, he's always like, what? What? Bagel bites, I'm hungry. One minute and 26 more seconds. So here's the tank again, over here. Daily tank update. It looks exactly the same. The clove polyps closed up. They're like only slightly peeking out right now. I don't know what's going on. I hope they're not dead already. <laughs> I was thinking, I think I need to get like a turbo snail to get rid of this hair algae on all the rocks. And then we need another sea hair if I'm gonna get rid of all the spryopsis. I also noticed I have a lot of those bristle worms in here. And I looked it up and it has to do with overfeeding the tank, which I was like, how am I overfeeding the tank? The tank barely gets fed. But I guess since there's only two fish, I don't really need to feed too much. That's the tank update. Come on, come on, bagel bites. Ah, yes. I have to wait one minute for it to cool down. There we go. Pepperoni and sausage bagel bites. Yes. So I'm taking a little break, watching some game explain videos here. <laughs> While eating my bagel bites. Then I gotta get back to work. I'm with Sean. We're at Best Buy again. We're looking at amiibos. Sean has a credit. He has a gift card, so he's trying to decide which amiibo he wants. Should he get the Mario Party 10 bundle? <laughs> Not even rare anymore. Yeah. This is the regular amiibo section. There's no Kirby here anymore. There's a lot of links. Pikachu. So Sean is considering that Luigi instead of the Super Mario one, which he really wanted, because this one will match his collection more. <laughs> That's what I did. I'm like, I can't get these lines because it doesn't match. The base is red. Look, they sound Mario. And it's and it's larger. These are larger than the the Smash ones. <laughs> Look at these, they have the white controller and the black controller. The white one's $16.99, the black one's $19.99. <laughs> John's like, that's so racist. <laughs> Pikachu and Luigi. I think that's what I'm going with. We gotta check to see if they have the game that we're looking for. 
<laughs> Squinkies too. <laughs> yes, they still have it. I don't think they even sold one copy of Squinkies too. Oh, and the Juju pet thing is still here. It'll never, it'll, it'll never sell. Since Gatsby chewed up all of the cardboard that used to go underneath all the furniture over here, I put cardboard there so that his balls from the eye fetch wouldn't roll underneath. But he chewed it that all up, so I was punishing him by not replacing anything so the balls would just roll underneath. Now I thought I'm gonna go and buy some 2x4s and probably just stick them underneath everywhere. Should probably be a little bit better than the cardboard because then you can't rip them up as easily. Home Depot time. Okay, let's find the cheapest ones. $2.42, it's not bad. Let's hope this fits in my car. Pull down the seat so it goes through the trunk. Hopefully that's enough space for this. Okay. It fits. It just fits. <laughs> okay, good. Okay. It fits. I asked if they actually cut the wood and they said no. How helpful is that? Anyway, okay. I guess I'm gonna have to cut it myself. I have a saw at home, but it's one of those really tiny saws. It's gonna take forever. So I gotta cut this all by myself. After I let out the dog. And I have to go to my Cornell event tonight. Lots of things to do. Okay, your present, Gatsby. I cut you some wood. <laughs> it has to fit under here, under here, and under the sofa, too. So, hopefully, <laughs> it'll work out. So it's gonna go under the furniture like this. We ran back home because I'm actually gonna volunteer at the Cornell Newly Accepted Students Reception um, because I graduated from Cornell University and I do this every single year, like twice a year. I have to go and take out the dog first and then I have to run off to the event. So let's go. <laughs> <laughs> we just got back, We're gonna add our Dynavite. I haven't really seen too many results other than the fact that Gatsby really loves it. So, here we go. It's like, oh, delicious. Got my class ring on. Okay, I'm ready to go. I like to go to these events just because it reminds me back of like my days at Cornell University and I get to see a lot of my friends there too who I haven't seen in a while. So I wasn't even thinking of going this year. This year I didn't I didn't volunteer to, to speak on the panel. So I think I'm just gonna, it's just gonna be easy for me. I'm just gonna take it easy. <laughs> just hang out with my friends. You was caught up in the rush and you was caught up in the thrill of it. You was with me way before I hit a quarter million and put you in the crib and you ain't never pay a it. I was killing it. Now you got me popping pills in it. Okay, we made it to the university club. Yes. Let's look at all the stuff here. All the people speaking. I guess I'm speaking on the panel. We're starting. So I'm getting back from the Cornell event. They actually did have me speak on the panel. So I was kind of like, ah, oh, stressed out. It didn't go as badly as last time, but yeah, now I'm back home, so I gotta work on Gatsby's wooden block thing. Back to sawing. So I made it back home. We're gonna do some cutting of this wood now. This is my only saw that I had. I did some calculations and this will be the minimum amount of cuts I'll need to make. One for each piece of wood, so. So we'll see how hard this is to cut. With the saw that ha barely has any teeth in it. I'm just gonna cut it over here because then I'll just vacuum it up. Bam! That was so hard to do with this tiny saw here. All the paint came out of it. It's a break. Oh, the things I did for my dog. Check it out. It's all done. Underneath all these areas. Yeah. Did that all for you. Now you can play with your eye fetch. Back up, back up, back up. There it goes. Bring it back. Okay. Inside. Inside. He's like, I'm tired. Put it inside, Gatsby. Gatsby, put it inside. Put it inside. Good dog. Good dog. Back up, back up, back up. At least it won't go underneath now. 
You're just gonna hang out there? He's like, that was so tiring. Really awesome before, but with a small tank like this, it's like very hard to upkeep. The small 